Today we're gonna take the cauliflower thins from Trader Joe's, which you can also get bigger versions of these, um, but I like the little ones, it's like a personal pizza. And we are going to make a brisket pizza out of it. I got the brisket at Costco, and it was kind of poorly planned because Anna isn't a huge fan of brisket, so I have to eat this like giant container that I opened before it goes bad. So I'm going to take a cauliflower thin, which I've already done, and crisp it up in the air fryer. Very simple. Don't spray it with anything. Don't have to season it. You just pop it into the air fryer. And now we're going to add our sauce. I'm just using sugar-free barbecue. I'm outside your house with a loaf of bread. Oh, no. Um, all right, so we're going to add the barbecue sauce. What's up, KCAT? What's up, Self Love? So once we get the barbecue sauce on there, just like a tablespoon, and we're gonna spread it with a round fork, like this. And yo, I'm gonna season it with some ranch seasoning. I don't know, something was just telling me. And I also told you guys, I'm gonna make my own ranch seasoning when I run out of this. I said this a month ago, I just didn't realize how long it would take for us to run out of this. What's up, Corey? What's up, Ray? Okay, we have the ranch seasoning. Now we're gonna add some onions. Actually, first the cheese. I got the cauliflower bread at Trader Joe's. A Little bit of shredded cheddar. Some onions that I just chopped up. And our brisket. And then I'm gonna do another layer of cheese, just like to lightly hold everything together. And I still have some brisket left that didn't fit. So we're going to, this is actually gonna be a very tall pizza. And now we're just gonna pop this into the air fryer. I'm so excited. This is cold and it's still super good. All right, so today I made some crispy chicken wings and I finally got it right. I'm gonna post the, uh, the recipe probably tomorrow or Tuesday. But this pizza should be done in like two or three minutes. So now we just wait. How did everybody's weekend go? Who is staying keto? <laughs> like until New Year's and who has kind of been on and off ever since Thanksgiving. Can I let Sophia say hi? Yeah. Sophia's gonna say hi guys, so I'm gonna go grab her. She hasn't been on a live in a while. She's kind of a hot mess right now. I'll show you guys the fa her favorite way to be held. So, what are my this is her favorite way for me to carry her. I just put her on my arm, make a little airplane, and I just show her things in the house and she gets so excited. And then now I have to. Hi, Sophia. Hi. We Sophia smiles so much now, it's crazy. I love you. E Oh, she might actually get excited because of the front-facing camera's on. Guys, her favorite toy now is just a mirror. So we put her on her playmat, and she immediately starts smiling and just, like, looking in the mirror. Oh, she just waved. Did you see it? Are you going to have a piece of the brisket pizza? Wow, she keeps trying to wave. Good job, Sophia. Oh my gosh, another wave. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna give her back to her mom. There you go. Oh my All right, that was our 
whole world. That's what we spend all day, every day entertaining. I'm glad you guys liked seeing her. Yeah, her nose is so tiny, it's cute. <sighs> she just brights up my day. She's been, so I'm gonna do a post soon about how she like had to be walked around with whenever she wanted to be held. She went through this little phase where we had to sit down with her or else she would like freak out. Or sorry, we couldn't sit down with her or else she would freak out. She wanted us to be like up and moving. And uh, I'm doing a post about that, but we recorded the post like two weeks ago when that was the case. Now she's like much better at entertaining herself with her toys, being a little content when we sit down. But if she's tired, like forget it. There are no smiles, just screams. <laughs> All right, like today I was walking her in the stroller and, uh, and she was awake the whole time for like 30 minutes and then she started freaking out meaning she's tired and ready for like a nap. And I didn't know what to do. I was like 15 minutes away from getting home. So I started like swirling the stroller, like going side to side. She instantly went to sleep. And then I was like, man, I don't want to mess with her nap right now. So I just added another 30 minutes to the walk and just took another lap around the neighborhood. Don't forget the pizza. Thank you for the comment. I totally forgot the pizza. We might have to make another one. Actually, no, it's perfect. All right, so I'm gonna put it on a plate and we're gonna eat this thing. All right, we're just going to cut it with a pizza cutter. Honestly, these pieces are going to be so tiny. I don't even think it needed to be cut like that, but... Oh my God, this looks so good. Mm. All right, we're gonna go take a picture of it. Right here. The most important part is pickles. So I'm just gonna grab some pickles from the fridge and then put those on, and then we're gonna taste test it. Okay, I've gotten three pickles. The pickles are kind of big, so I don't know how they're gonna look, but, all right. Now we take the picture. It almost looks perfect. It's just a little blurry. I think the first picture I took was the best. It kind of just looks like messy now. The pickles are too big. Maybe I'll just put them on the side. I'm sorry I'm taking so much time taking pictures, but this is fine. 
All right, so now we just take a bite. And Anna's actually waiting for me to, um, to take over Sophia while she uses, we've all this like Peloton, like knockoff thing. Um, it's like an exercise bike, but it's not a Peloton, but it's basically one. So here's our bite. Oh my God. Oh my God. All right, I wish I would have gotten a better picture to do this justice because this is amazing. And it has to have the pickles. The pickles make it so good. Mm. I just folded up two pieces. Guys, I wasn't knowing what to expect, but... Mm. Oh my god. So I tried this on a Soma bagel the other night. Mm. And I didn't like it. I tried this exact recipe. Minus the pickles because I ran out. On a Sola bagel. I wasn't a fan of it. I thought the bagel was too overpowering. Mm. But this is like ridiculously good. Mm. Alright guys. I'm going to get off here. I love you. I believe in you. I'll see you tomorrow.